Hey everyone, my name is Ario and I'm going to show you three methods of the fastest way to take care of today's target, legless wild non-fish creature for the graph adversarial event. Recommendation before we begin would be to do this when it's not raining. For some reason, especially on the second method, whenever I would go to take a picture of them, they wouldn't even be there because the rain would cause them to hide. The first method is taking pictures of animal and geocrystal flies. Alicia Waypoint just west of Mount Tianhang in Liwei. We want to head toward the entrance of this waterway here. When we arrive you want to stick to the left and there's going to be five geocrystal flies that we can take a picture of. There should be two in the top and one floating around in front of you somewhere. Once we're done with that go ahead and jump down to the second ledge we were on before and take care of the last two that are remaining. From here we need to head to the large tree in Mondstadt at Windrise. There's going to be four more animal crystal flies that we can take a picture of. When we arrive turn around and the first crystal fly is going to be to the right. As soon as you're done with him, move to the left, and there's going to be two more in the back of the tree on the left side. Our last destination for method 1 is going to be Windwall Highland in Mondstadt, just above Dawn Winery. The second they're there, all we need to do is stay still. We just turn around and take care of two crystal flies that are right behind us, and the last is going to be just down the ledge to the left. He could be hiding behind the tree, but he's there. Now, if we don't have Sayu, then I would recommend Method 2 or 3. Method 2, we go ahead and head over to Watasumi Island. It's going to be the southern east most fast travel point. As soon as we're there, we go ahead and head west, head to the water, and we're going to be able to take a picture of Red Findunagi. Just past this first chunk of land, there'll be one more Unagi to take a picture of. Continue to move forward, all while being careful with aggro, odds are you're going to aggro them. You should be able to head a little forward and then to the right toward the end of that next little chunk of land to take a picture of two more redfin. As soon as we're done with that, let's go ahead and get out of there because they're chasing us and then go ahead and move forward a little further past this next island and there's going to be a last either two or three that are going to be in the water. Next we head to the southernmost point of Watazumi Island. But be careful at this point to stay to the right, especially if a bird is there. If you get too close to the bird, then the bird will scare the Unigami back into the water. There's gonna be three of them here. Go ahead and take your photos. And if for any reason you did happen to mess up, if we continue along this beach, there's gonna be another one just on the side. And then all the way at the end of this beach, there's gonna be two more that we can take a picture of. It's gonna be a total of 12 that you can take a picture at this location. The last method can turn to a heck of a crap show if we're not careful but I'm going to show you the best and easiest way to do it. We want to go ahead and head over to Sumeru, into the desert. If you have the fast travel point, Domain City of the Deceased, you can use the other fast travel point, but it's, it's more of a hassle to get to where we need to get to if we do that. Once we arrive, head down the hole, but be careful not to go all the way down. If you head all the way down, you're going to have a bad time. So we want to go one level down and head north. When we reach the next hole, we need to go down. There's going to be two crystal flies that we could take a picture of before we head down. When we do head down, a bunch of water slimes that spawn. Make sure you kill them all while staying away from the serpents that we're going to take a picture of in a bit. If you get too close to them, they're going to start aggroing and especially with the crystal flies, they'll scatter. As soon as you're done with the slimes, head a little forward and take a picture of the serpent that's right in front of us. Then in order to not aggro anything, you're going to want to stay left. Continue on and take a picture of the three crystal flies and the two next serpents. Then head a little forward in order to take a picture of the last two serpents we need to take care of our 10 film for the day. As soon as we're done, head to Fontaine and speak to Lupine Pauline to turn in your rewards. If you liked today's video and found it useful, then definitely like and subscribe to receive future Genshin content. I'll be making builds and guides very soon and also live streaming on Twitch and we'll leave the details on my channel. Until then, I thank you all for your support and I'll see you on the next stream or on the next video.